Everyone, let's make a dish using getta and duck sauce. Today we're using the sweet and sour version to make a delicious pepper steak that is easy, simple for summer supper. Follow along and I'll show you how to make it. Enough to cover the bottom and then turn on our heat to a medium high heat. There we go. Next up, we are going to add our meat that is coated in some salt and cornstarch into our pan. It doesn't have to be hot yet. We put it in there, using a spoon, spread it out evenly. This is going to coat our meat and make it tender. And give it that crispy deliciousness. While our meat is cooking, let's get ready with the sauce. In a large bowl, you are going to add some soy sauce. You hear the meat in the background, yum! Some white vinegar. About two teaspoons of sriracha sauce, depending on how spicy you like stuff. About a teaspoon of hosen sauce, or Worcester sauce, and then you have about a tablespoon of sh white sugar. There we go. And then some spices. I'm using a teaspoon of salt, a half a teaspoon of pepper, and a half a teaspoon of chili powder. Let me go check on my meat and I'll be right back. Now we're going to add some geffen fruits and garlic cubes. I'm going to add four cubes. I like to say with these type of recipes, these simple recipes, to do what works for you. Next, we're going to add the most important ingredient of this all, Gaffin Sweet and Sour Duck Sauce. This is what the dish is made of. If I could get this thing open, wee -hee. I'll be back. <laughs> okay, so I am going to add some, about a half a cup, and I'm going to mix this sauce together. Yum. This is what dreams are made of. <laughs> Literally, I love Chinese food, anything, yum. Let the garlic melt and mix it again. Now that our meat is mostly cooked through, we are going to add vegetables of our choice. I like to add some onions, some green pepper, and some baby corn. Now that you added that all, the vegetables you like, you're going to mix it up and add another tablespoon about of oil. Keep mixing the sauce like your life depends on it. I mean, not the sauce, the meat, not like your life depends on it, but so it cooks. I'm gonna raise the heat a drop, just like that, and let the meat fully cook through with the vegetables. The vegetables should still be crunchy, but partially cooked. Okay, now that the dish is coming through, continue stirring. You want the onions to clear, the peppers to soften a drop, and the baby corn, you know, to get fully coated, and the meat should cook through. Once your meat is no longer pinkish, we are going to add the sauce. That will be another minute about. Now that the meat is mostly cooked, we are going to add in our sauce that we made before. And lower the heat a drop, just a drop, and mix it all together. Once it looks like this, let it cook a drop longer so everything combines together. And then, to remove it from the heat, and serve it over rice, as is. Let me just taste it with you guys. This is amazing, I'm telling you. The meat. Like store Mmm! Mmm! And this is all delicious. Make it today using Gaffin Duck Sauce. It's amazing. You'll thank me later.